Hi everybody, Arush here. Welcome back to History Shorts. Today, I will be speaking on the Constitution of India. The Constitution of India, which is the Supreme Law of India, was adopted on 26th November 1949. It came into effect on 26th of January 1950. The 26th of January is celebrated as the Republic Day of India. In 1928, the All Parties Conference set up a committee in Lucknow which was to prepare the Constitution of India, also known as the Nehru Report. Once India got independence from the British, from 1947 to 1950, the same legislation continued to be implemented as India was a dominion of Britain for those three years. India ceased to be a dominion of British crown and became a sovereign democratic republic on 26 January 1950. It took three years to draft the Constitution of India, holding 11 sessions over a 165-day period. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar was a wise constitutional expert. He had read the constitutions of 60 countries. He is often regarded as the father of Indian constitution. The drafting committee of the Constitution of India was headed by Dr. B. R. Ambedkar and supported by C. Rajagopalachari, Dr. Rajendra Prasad, Sardar Vallabhai Patel, Jawaharlal Nehru, Abul Kalam Azad, Shama Prasad Mukherjee. The Indian Constitution is the world's longest constitution for any sovereign nation. The Constitution has a preamble and 470 articles grouped into 25 parts. The parts include the preamble, citizenship, fundamental rights and duties, directive principles of state policy, etc. The fundamental rights include right to equality, right against exploitation, right to freedom of religion, right to education and culture, right to constitutional remedies, and right to privacy. The fundamental duties include respecting the national anthem and the national flag, to follow the noble ideals that inspired the struggle for freedom and to protect the unity and integrity of India, to defend our country, to promote harmony among all Indians irrespective of caste, religion, region and gender, to value and preserve our rich heritage, to protect the natural environment, and to safeguard public property. The preamble is an introductory statement to the Indian constitution. We the people of India, having solemnly resolved to constitute India into a sovereign, socialist, secular, democratic republic and to secure to all its citizens justice, liberty, equality, fraternity. In our Constituent Assembly, this 26th day of November 1949, do hereby adopt, enact and give to ourselves this constitution. The constitution of India is handwritten with each page decorated by the artist of Shantini Ketan. Jai Hind and Vande Mataram.